What is going on and welcome on in to another live stream. Two videos just dropped, putting tutorial and the what's in my bag just dropped. Hope you guys like it. Hope it helps. You guys asked, I try to deliver today's video is going to be uh, some EA, the patch update. I will go through that in a second. And then I'm going to play my TGC tours. We qualified for the kinetic division this week. So I will cover that as well. Uh, for anyone who's not watching, I'm going to kind of go through the patch notes right here. Let me just say, I have not seen a sports game, especially anything that I've played recently that has patch notes to this extent and to this detail. So it's kind of really cool to, um, to actually get some, some patch notes like this, but obviously the three click. Well, actually, I think I'm going to actually play with the three click a little bit, kind of get a, get used to it so I can give you guys the tutorial video on the three click. Uh, that has now been added new visual settings, fast play. We can putt meter enable, disable. I've already disabled my putt meter, disabled my button hints as well. Putting grid improvements. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Uh, fixed issues where putting grid beads sometimes went into the wrong direction. Hopefully that actually i haven't had any issues i've been playing for a bit i haven't had any issues so i'm looking forward to that fix an issue where the visual representations of the cup was slightly larger than actual physics i didn't notice that uh chip shot now always defaults to the shortest club available we've noticed that issue to be a big part of it so that's very good there variety of apparel and gear has been added to the store Shot Types Explanation Guide is there for you. UI fixes for private matches, screen information, round settings, sub-tab, disappear. There's a whole extensive. I also posted this link if you guys really wanted to cover that as well. Amateur leaderboard, unable to scroll. Store, career, fix situations where players were not receiving the open achievement after winning. So it's good that they're fixing some of these achievements. Intro banners now show score for golfers. That's a pretty good addition. Challenges automatically skip player reactions around the green challenge two can now be completed. Fix issue where the rewards were not given in the Cobra sponsor challenge. I've, I've had a couple people hit me up about that. So I'm glad that is fixed as well. Uh, there's is an extensive list. The, the uh, For people who want mouse support, uh, they added a navigation points prompt, jumping to player position. So there's a lot, there's a lot in here. And I linked that to my, I linked that to my actual uh, post. So hopefully that helps. I mean, this patch has been pretty good. I haven't had any big issues with it, but I do want to play, let's play a couple holes with the three click. Just want to see what, oh, I have a reward. Do I have a reward? Oh, wow, I got a lot of rewards. Didn't even realize I had so many rewards. Rare ball spec and some VC. Nothing too crazy. All right, we're gonna go into our settings here. We're gonna play a little bit. Play a little bit with the three click. Let's do it for both putting. I'm just gonna put it to normal for now, simply because. And we're gonna turn the swing meter on. I just wanna know what it looks like. And also, you know, we'll give it a test run. Play like a quick three hole match. I wouldn't say match, but what course shall we play? Let's play. I haven't played St. Andrews yet. Let's just play the first nine. My guy's a 94 overall now, so really climbing through the charts here. Now, from the home bright. of golf, EA Sports, so proud to welcome you to the old course at St. Andrews. 
Rich Lerner up in the tower. Please to be joined. All right, so let's see what this three click is all about. And Frank, I'm not a big three clicker, but course, it's interesting. Bunkers, 112 of them in all. Oh, it's kind of just like their. Oh, there's probably gonna be. I didn't even look. To be honest, I kind of. Yeah, it's definitely in the water. Oh, uh, almost one out it over. You know, if they're downwind, you got you'd be surprised. Yeah, it's fine. Run sixty or seventy yards. We're not really caring about the you score here. Wondering why that bunker's down there. And then it's kind of like their kicking it. meter so just, just for keep your eyes um, open, but yeah, for their it's, football it's games. It's a beautiful walk, and um, that's really the way golf was invented and should be played, especially. Interesting. In Andrews. Oh, it's actually a harder. Ah, uh, they're still lagging it though. It's gonna go over the hole. There's still latency with well, this, that's so I actually best, think it's be harder to use. Frank, if he's able to get out of here with his par. Well, you might forget it. I won't. <laughs> Far from his best. It's pretty easy with the putt. Okay, safely in for par here at the opening hole. Overall challenges were fixed because I am competing challenges with all the stars completed and no rewards are given. Um, I thought that they were mostly fixed. I had not. We can te if there's specific ones, let me know. Uh, I can after I after I play this couple holes. I can. I actually I like the look of it. I think the three click looks really cool. Um, wow, look at the ball run. Yeah, it might so be you know you're playing on on uh, fast firm. Second shot for him now at the second Scotland courses. I like the look of it better compared to, uh, I guess 2K23 is not, or 2K is not going to be able to put out that they're the number one place for free click. But Tracy, if, you, if there's specific um, challenges that you're talking about, let me know. And I can test it out and we can get some, some stars and you can figure it all out. But as always, you guys know the drill. Uh, you ask the questions, I answer the questions. If not, then I'm just going to play a little bit and uh, go about it. But I hope the putting guide that I just dropped... I hope the putting guide that I just dropped helps a lot of people out. I know it was a highly requested video. Well, you can't um, walk out and drop it any better. And then on top of that, that I, I did a what's in my right bag there. and where to focus my skills or your skills. So, so hopefully those help as well. To go here as he'll set up his second... This is a really awesome course. See if I can hit the spinner here. I don't know if I'll get it to spin, but... I think the three-click is actually more difficult than a regular swing simply because... It, uh... The lag... The challenges are all fixed. Thank you, Frederick. A putt for birdie. And any movement in this putt is going to be slight in nature. This is one you're looking to make. It's very slow for putting, but it's actually... Oh, yes. Very impressive right there. And that goes down for a birdie. I'm getting used to it now. You just got to... You got to pre... Pre-plan it. You gotta click it before it, because there is a little bit of latency. Uh, you can't drive it much better than that. That's the quick pickup of the tee. Right yeah, I don't feel like middle. it's very difficult, DJ. Couldn't ask for anything better. Split the fairway. I think it's actually. I don't think it's shot. that hard at all. If once you get the hang of it, you gotta. Uh, you just gotta pre pre-plan the button click. Once you do that, it's pretty pretty routine stuff. That's a good yeah. shot, and more importantly too, a green and Be interesting when they do their shots. online tournaments if they allow if it's three click is going to have their own, or if um, or if it's going to be universal for anyone. Yes, because this is a lot. This is a lot easier to be honest. It's a birdie. 
push that score to three under for the round. Yeah, no, for, I agree for sure. Now let's see how max we can hit this. I mean, it's it's pretty easy. But I mean, it's good because it gives people options. It gives people um, so that ball gives people down, different rough, differences of a um, little bit on that tee ball. It gives a lot of options. You know, not everybody likes the swing meter. I didn't look at the wind on this one. What's going on, Smooth? How you yeah, doing? Sensational shot here on and two on the par five, and Frank, a good look. Yeah, I know the update, to be exactly honest. Right, I agree. Good shots People were still complaining, five. but I guess more than well um, there's a lot. I know, I know they're obviously... The game's only been out for a few weeks now. It's not going to be perfect, but at the same time, it, it feels and it's playing pretty good. Okay, his fine play continues. I mean, he is dialed in as the short birdie. Three play click is um, gets him to four it's not going to be for round. me, but if there are certain people who need assistance with it, I can put out some videos on it. I think it's actually. I actually like it a lot better than the 2K23 three click, to be honest. Yeah, that's a nice swing, and the result is going to be a Let's get one more bird in a row. Just fine. And, uh. The big drive got him here. Now a short one for his second. Where's the spinner? Well, it's been enough. Oh. Pretty good stuff here. 13 feet away. Power through this break. Yeah, the good play can All right, I think that's good enough. Five letter through six holes. <laughs> I think the three click. It's definitely a good option for a lot of people. Um, who do, who struggle or can't use or just prefer not to use the joysticks? It's it's an interesting one, but what do we do? Let's um, I just won my last career tournament. I want to crank up the difficulty a little bit, and let's put my settings back. We are going back to right stick. Back to hard. Swing meter off. Everything else should be pretty good. I'm gonna keep the beads on. But that's just because. Well, I've also been kind of testing with the elevation and the wind reading, so I need to play a little bit more with that because if you turn those off, there is a color arrow, a yellow and a red. And I need to figure out when that changes from yellow to red so that way you know. Do I use the Texas Wedge? I do not. I do not use the Texas Wedge. EA Sports and the PGA. Um, in my what's in the bag, you see that I actually don't have any points towards. I have two points, skill points, towards putting. Outside of that, I don't have anything else towards it anymore. I don't really feel like it was worthwhile anymore. Um, but I also really like the chip with the 60 degree wedge. So that is right up my alley for what I like. We've got a tie at the top at six under par. And that is not a fairway hit. Feel free to ask whatever questions. If there's certain challenges you guys want me to do that you need assistance with. So um, week four, now's the time the to ask, so many folks around the and here in I'm just going to play, I can't hit this spinner on the rough, huh? it's pretty cool that you can't do that. What am I supposed to hit here? Two wins in three tournaments. None That's of these an clubs, I, I don't want to hit the runner, I guess I'm going to have to hit a pitch shot. Unbelievable. And now they're going to play in front of 800,000 people over the course of four rounds, so that alone will be quite incredible, but... As you said, two out of three. That's an old meat life song, isn't it? Two out of three. Ain't bad. 
I don't know why it didn't give me any options to hit anything other than the pitch shot. Everything else was way too far. So another right. event getting underway here, Frank, and we look Up at our feet. featured golfer coming in fresh off another one victory four short days ago. You know, it's funny what confidence can do peak. for you. Early in the season, you're probably just hoping to try and make some cuts, contend once in a while. Now you're coming into tournaments as one of the favorites to win. As long as you don't get ahead of yourself, because, you know, there's that sort of phrase, you can be a little too cocky. Uh, confidence is a good thing, though. I, I just think take a little step back. I mean, all the back slapping's finished. You won last week. Remember how you did that. Remember how well you played. What got there? That was a series of good shots. So Thursday, you've got to start doing exactly the same. Oh, and the same attitude. Close. Couldn't ask for much more on that putt. Hammer through the break. Safely in. It's a par here at the first. And he'll stay at level par. Gotta find the fairway here. That is not the fairway. This starting up the right side. Oh, it is the fairway. We got a lucky break there. Lucky break. A friendly kick. I never got those. It could have stayed in the rough for the same price. All right, now so we got to capitalize it. on the break here. His second from and my the favorite rest. shot. Will knock down action. A knock down underswing. It's max. Oh, the wind really took it. Any tips you have on putting? Got to be disappointed. Uh, today is your lucky day. I don't know if you just saw, but right before I went on this live stream, I put out an entire putting tutorial video. But if there's a specific putting, mm, that is a good looking pass. I will go through it right now for you. To stop in a good place, leaving just a few feet for par. That um, when it comes to short putts, anything inside five feet, he'll stay at I like to just power through the break. Um, right now in this game and how it's set up, you can't really, can't really hit over the hole. So if you can't hit over the hole, then there's no real reason to uh, worry about it. Might as well just take the break out of it as much as possible. That's going to wind up safely in the fairway. But when I get on a green, I'll talk about it. Let's bring in Nota Begay the third. Tee shot has given the player a chance to go for this green in two. Just have to be mindful of covering the ravine, which protects it, the entire front part of the green. Is it enough? Is it enough? Nope. I didn't really want to hit six iron because I did not want it to, uh, not the place to, be. It is into to the really carry on. In front of this third green. Ball sitting in the wash and the unpredictable I still, have, I still need to this fix this part. One. If you are hitting the flop shot, the wind affects it, so you have to be very careful of that. So, like, for instance, on these putts right here, you can't really get penalized for hitting it too hard, so you might as well just take the break out of it. Unless you underswing, and then you take the break out of it for no, no reason whatsoever. I've been trying to get used to the no putting meter thing, but Nicely done. It is a far here at the that's third. my big thing. And he'll you just completed breaking putts, the basic challenges where your rewards are collected at maybe... Did you go into the rewards tab and collect your rewards? Let's see, it's more cross breeze. I want to hit it 170. Because if you don't go into the rewards tab, then you're, um, you won't have your rewards until you collect them. But I was doing some rewards earlier today, and I had no issues. That was obviously well struck, but it came in a little too hot, and that one's going to run out and leave So, for instance, uh, this movie, he would have I'll go through this one, right? So, you, you'll see it in my putting tutorial guide. You want to read these square by square. So, for instance, this square right here is moving a little bit left, and then it's going to straighten out. 
and then it's going to start moving to the right. So you have to ask yourself, is it going to move more left or is it going to move more right? Essentially, to get this here, we're going downhill. I need to enter it right here for it to go through this part here. So we need to start it just here because what's going to happen? If I start it here, it's going to move a little bit and then it's going to straighten out and it should enter this spot right in here. Let's put this back to where it was, down seven inches. Hit it a little bit through the brake. Hit a lot of it through the brake. There we go. That's him. How to get three stars driving challenge two. All right, after uh, this round, I'll, I'll do that one. Sounds good. Sounds good. Are you doing it on hard or are you doing it on arcade mode? Shows mode select where stroke play and the eight other selection areas no are here. there, but that no is into the fairway. From the fairway, hmm. we check in with Noda. The fifth always plays one of the most I'm not too holes sure. You might Scott might have to contact so EA to be honest. Gives you the green light to go ahead and try and make a three. All right. I do not want power approach. This is the shot I want. Oof. Well, had a good look at the green, but couldn't hash it in. In the rough now, wondering what might have been. What course are we playing on? This course is a lot. Um, the ground is... Oh, I missed my thumb. The course is this course is a lot harder ground wise than um, because you've got to judge what it feels like. The other ones that I played grass between club face and ball. That's why the ball doesn't come out as quick. Well, thank you. know, it's not ideal, but sometimes psychologically a bogey's not that bad. It would have been easy to come completely off the rails there, so I'll take a bogey. Let's find the short stuff. Hit a good approach shot. That's a good drive. Fine. That works. Perfect spot to play this second, middle of the fairway. I agree. Goes back just a smidge. Why am I underswinging it so poorly right now? In golf, you know, you've heard the term mulligan. You'd love that to do over there, wouldn't you? I mean, that's just, uh, that's very poor from that range. A birdie putt down to Iona. Yeah, it's a long putt, so pace is important, but there's not a whole lot to it. I fancy the chances of getting this close. She fancies the chances. Good putt left. Nicely read there. It is a par here at Lots the of pars. And he'll stay. Gotta warm up eventually. Uh, six iron drive shot. Go. That should be a good shot. No? Three percent under swing. No, that is we are the all over the place two today. Bunkers around this uh, seventh green. Now from the bunker, yeah, just a little splash out on this par three. Uh, that one kind of took off on him. That'll happen sometimes coming out of the bunker, and that scoots right on by. 
No, the putter bails that him out par. there. That's in for a par. And he'll remain right where he is. It's so different coming from the three click. How easy that was compared to this. The one thing I'll say about the um, the wind, sometimes it's a little bit. I mean, I think it's probably because the wind Let gusts, which I do like. From the right. Did a great is the wind gusts? The shot it makes it very, shot coming up. And we say very interesting sometimes Ionis. how One, three, nine is the difficult number. it can be. And that wind, it's coming from right to left, so you might need to start like, this a little bit to the right. See how much side. this actually affects it. So like, look how much that affected that. And that's a knockdown shot, too. Now, is that because of the fast or because they... Because I feel like the, the wind, the left to right winds weren't affecting shots as much before. Need three boxes. Come on, give me one. Ah. No, kind of underread that one, and it winds up missing below the hole. Okay, that in four par here at the end. While putting with the putt lines, the ball tracks more on the lines than when you go outside the lines to compensate either way. Um. Yeah, I mean that just might. I mean they did fix the putting grid, if that's what you're mentioning. Yeah, nothing to fault there. Good balance, good follow through, and a good start. Hitting some fairways here. We just gotta get into the greens. Let's go to Noda. Fairway at the ninth, one of the widest on the golf course. So ball easily finds the fairway. Now can take dead aim at this whole location to this narrow green. Oh, it's gonna spin too much. It's a solid shot and a green in regulation, but a little away from the band. A long one coming up here for birdie. There it is. Finally, we get one to go. It is a birdie here at the ninth. Even part front nine is not the best work I've ever done, but on this front side. See if we can chase six under on the back. I think that's easily in reach. Hit the power drive here. Ooh, definitely didn't need to hit the power drive. Ah, uh, that's gonna be into the rough right behind. Thought the seven mile an hour wind would have held it up, but that's not. So a poor tee shot at ten. Now it's still at 98 percent, and this is why I don't really need high recovery. Up one, five. 88 yards just want to keep this left this flag to be honest slight underswing just hit it way too hot and been doing all this testing with the meter on it's gonna fly out of that line it is always so hard to judge the flight coming out of that kind of line Oh. Oh, I don't like the three wood. Good? Any oh, other clubs that, that are good? Well uh, so I put a four wood rush. in the bag. So but you might want to, because I wanted the four wood to stop a little bit more. So I don't use a three wood. I use a four wood. I just change the loft of it. <clears throat> but you also could potentially put in a hybrid. I don't know what yardage you're trying to achieve, though. Like, are you trying to get at par fives and two? Or are you just need another club to hit into par threes? Essentially, what is your over your your player's overall power? the fairway, we check in with Noda. Great tee shot here at the 11th. Now has a chance to go at the whole location on the left half of the green. But you have to be concerned about the water that wraps around the backside. Ah, 
Ah, oh, big underswing again. Should be all right though. Should we go a little bit more? Eight or nine feet, excellent shot. There we go. Now we're chasing six under on the back line. There's one. We got two par fives. Let's get this lead. All right, so we're down two into five. Three extra, 183 is the number. What do we got for a knockdown? We can hit 183 knockdown. Ah. So I feel like there's a bigger penalty for the fast now. Like they cranked up the hard difficulty. I feel like they, uh, they increased if you're not perfect. Ooh, almost dumped it. I feel like they increased the difficulty. Oh boy. Just about flew that one in the hole. Luckily got it to stop. Not a bad shot. Yep. Emporium, I'm the same way. Four one's been really good for me. I just have to give the win more justice. I need to do my crosswinds tutorial and calculations and figure out essentially how much these crosswinds actually play an effect on the ball. That was a bad meter. Hopefully I stay in the fairway. That's not bad. First cut. Alright, up to... Ah, oh, this ball ain't gonna stop. Five iron's gonna run on. Take the slope. Come back down, come back down. Oh man, that was gonna be so good. Not quite the accuracy. Missed it. Hair to the right. Oh ball tracking. Yeah, I'm not too sure. Oh, I wanted that eagle. Pretty good chip there, though. Tap in bird gets us two under. Hunting the leaders down. It's a birdie here at 13. I did crank up the AI difficulty as well, so we'll see what they, obviously six under is not terrible. Let's see. I've been trying to use the power drive just to test it out, but I just don't have it at a high enough level yet. That was a good swing. Perfect. Slightly fast, exactly what I like there. Do just fine. So I only oh, we gotta hit this one close, 128. Give it enough wind. To the front of the green, but one two eight to the hole, and that wind it's coming from right to left. So you might need to start this a little bit to the right hand side. I want to make sure I cover that flag. The wind's not going to take it this time, is it? Of course not. Still a pretty good shot though. Pin high, yeah, number was spot Safely on. on Give myself a good look at it. This one measures out to 15 feet. Let's go. Yeah, that's good putt. A Three under on the back one. nine. We're warming up. We just needed nine holes to warm up. That's all we needed. Just a little quick little nine holes. But as always, guys, you know it's on the drill. Feel free to uh, ask any questions you have. I'm going to cover... I have not forgotten about you. I will do the... Uh... Oh, baby. That's a lot of wind. Stay there. Um, for a good round going here on this Thursday, Kuro, I will cover the driving challenge after for you too. after this. We are on hole 15. Now, the if there's other challenges this, you guys need me to do, just throw it in the chat, and I will... Uh... All right. 
So it's actually playing a 188. Keep this little short left, try to get an eagle putt here. Oh, that was an underswing. Still got an eagle putt though. That worked out really well, landing just short, gets that little bump onto the green, and now maybe eight a inches. Bump on the scorecard, Frank. If this putt goes down for an eagle. Well worked out, second shot, Rich. You could not fly that ball on the green and expect it to finish up on that front third. So this is up seven. Let's put it back to where it was. So I need to put it there. Just get it started. Slight underswing. Hit the hole, hit the hole, hit the hole. Oh! Yep. Not bad. I had to put a little extra into that one, but got it there. That's a pretty good effort. A straightforward should be another bird, though. And that one four under. We need two more to hit the quota. Fifteen, and he'll get it now to four under par. Just two oh, shots. Oh, state! This is the first time I've seen the stadium hole. This is pretty cool. They did a really good job with this. Look at the multiple tiers. They did a really good job with this. I'm interested to see the fan reaction. Let's see. Hopefully, I can hit the green. All right, sit down. It says playing 170, 172. I'm going to play all seven of that, helping, actually. So, 165 is the number I'm trying to hit here. Let's keep it just short. Make sure we hit this green. Come on, you can do it. Or not. It's tracking. Oh, did I go too far? Oh, Man, this they gonna boo me? The back of the green, but it's oh, it's kind of quiet. Spot. I feel like I should put this. By right, now they're booing me. A little bit delayed. Oh, so I can't Texas wedge this anymore. No problem. I'm gonna just chip this in. For all the elements this game has been in sync today, a terrific shot right there. It's all about 16 on 2K23 is more realistic. Okay, that'll be a par here at 16. Are you serious? And he'll remain at four under. What, what, what do you think is more realistic about that? Crowd noise reaction. I mean, they booed me for missing the green, and then they cheered it when I got it on. Off the green, cut off the fringe. This will be long and tricky, but it is a look for eagle. Go in. Mm. Another excellent shot from around the green. All right, five under on the back nine. Can we finish off with one more to go six under on the back nine? Within a shot of the lead. And then we're gonna do some challenges. If there's other challenges you guys want me to figure out or do, let me know. I want to hit a power drive here. Try to get inside a hundred yards. Oh, that's a good shot. Good swing. Oh, bomb ski. Crowd's going crazy. This 
game not so we can tie the lead here. It's about putting the ball in the right position, and that's what he's we done. We get the finesse really of the Good opportunity to make a birdie. Let's see what he can do. Can I hit the knockdown. Seven yards, knock. second shot. I have to hit the finesse shot. Make sure to get it there. Roll up, roll up, roll up, roll up. Uh, all right, we got a little 11 foot putt here. Hit the back nine quota. Gonna play it a little bit through the break. Let's go. Six under back nine. To back 30s at 17 and 18. On hard difficulty. Look at the opening round leader. Matt Fitzpatrick came out. Just through in an eight under round, but hey, we're right there. Even more Let's do some challenges and then we're gonna hop over to TGC. So that'll do it for my partner here in the tower. So we'll like to exit. I mean, Schusler, I'll I'll hop it when I switch over to 2K23, I'll hop on hole 16. We can we can compare. Alright, uh we want play and we want challenges absolutely name the challenge you want that's what we're here for all right so kiro i gotta go back up you said something about driving challenge how to get three stars driving challenge number two um is that please let me know is that in the skills trainer driving challenges number two this one so you need to do a long drive here so uh, if you see there, it says caddy tip, long drive. And some people have reported that there was an issue with this one. Um, but you want a driver, make sure it's a driver, power of 100% and fairway and regulation. So, like I say, when you're doing these, I highly recommend, I mean, you can play it on hard if you want to. But... If you're just trying to just grind the challenges, go on arcade mode. Um, obviously, I have all three stars on this one, so I'm not going to be able to show you the stars, but this is essentially what you need to do. I like to put it on arcade mode when I play these, if I'm just grinding. Apply that change. All right, so be very cautious, right? So see how it just presets you with a forward? You cannot hit the forward. You have to hit the driver. So hit the driver. Now you have to hit a 100% power. So the swing has to be 100% or more. So you have to go past that little tick mark. And then you have to hit the fairway. So it has to be between these bunkers. And you have to use the driver. So make sure you're using the driver. I like to just over swing these ones. And you just do this five times. Make sure you over swing. Do not under swing. If you hit an under swing on any of them, it's not going to work. So you see there another over swing. But I'm on the edge here, so I'm just adding a little bit of spin to it. And then you just do this. I guess I'll do it all five times. But just make sure that you're using your driver. And if you do this all five times, you overswing all five times. If you underswing any of them, you're not going to get the challenge. Just speed this up here. Arcade, overswing, yep. I do the arcade just because I'm, if you're grinding it, I, I mean, it doesn't matter to me, but you see like sometimes when you get flirty with these bunkers like this, you can just spin the ball and then I lose the challenge if I was doing all five. But, you know, I don't like to, you don't need to use the power drive. You can just use a regular drive. Whatever one you have the highest, I have gold for my regular drive. So just make sure you overswing. 
I had to power up my swing with the left bumper to get it to 100%. Overswing alone didn't do it for me. Mm. Uh, that could have been an issue. I, I mean, I did it. That could have been an issue with when the challenges were... I mean, I take your word for it. Um, but give it a try. Let us know um, how that's exactly how I did it, and it worked for me. PGA Coaching Academy. So then you, um, you want advanced shot making challenges. All right. And then you want advanced shot making par three. This one right here. Get one birdie, par or better on all three holes. Earn all three advanced greens in regulation. All right, so. This is what you need to do. You need to shot shape these. Sigmund. So, like I said, if you're okay with it, you're going to put it on arcade. All right, so this first one, calculate your numbers. So we're down 32 feet, which is just about 10, 11. So, and then we're going into two, so nine. So 160 is the flag. If you read this properly, you don't want to go long of the flag, right? If you go long of the flag, you're going to be in a lot of trouble. So I'd actually end up, it's better to be short than it is to be long. So I'd be playing for like a 158 shot. Or yeah, yeah, one, 158 shot. I'm going to go 159 and just hit a little bit of an underswing because I can spin this. But you need advanced GIR. So in the bottom left corner, you can see that you can either hit a fade, you can hit a draw. Uh, I'm going to hit a fade. So you want to hit a fade or some, some sort of shot shaping. And then you hit... Oh, I have my setting. Oh, did they change my settings? Or did my settings not save? There we go. And you can spin it if you want to. Let's see what kind of spin we need here. There we go. So that's what you kind of need. And then you just got to make these putts. Which, if you got a little putt read here as well. Unless you power it through the brake. But essentially, that's what you got to do. I don't know. How, there's three holes here. I can give you the calculations for all of them. Nice. All right, so 78. Contact's rolling up. Uh, is 28, so that's 19. Sorry, my contact just rolled up in my eye. Uh, so 19 down. No, 20, 29 down. I'm sorry. 26 down. Multitask. 26 down. So minus 26 from 15 gives you an extra 9. Oh, I. Yeah, 26. Sorry. Try not to lose a contact here and do math at the same time. Doesn't usually work well for the for the mind. All right. So twenty six down. Put it at about eighty nine. This is probably going to spin a lot coming from this elevation. So you probably want to use a knockdown unless you are. I mean, we are going to shot shape this one too. Um, it's too much club. Sixty degrees probably gonna spin a little bit, but we're gonna hit a draw because it's gonna add some spin to it. Okay. 
Can't really see which way I need to spin it yet. Oh, wow. I hit a major underswing there. Pretty straight putt, though. You just can't hit a major underswing there like I just did. But you can still make the putt from birdie from there. So there's one. Just note when you shot shape, it's going to change your distances and your yardages, right? So you got to play for it. So in that situation, it was 26, but then I was throwing a big draw in it. So it's going to draw more. So you actually have to give it a little bit more. Um, so for instance, in this one is 52 down. So it's what, 17? No. Yeah. Yeah, 17. 17 down with another two helping, so 19, just about 20 yards. 205's flags, so 185. 185's the number, but let's hit a fade into this one. Hit a high fade. So if you hit it high or low, it's going to change your numbers. So I'm just going to hit a regular fade here. And hit this shot. I overswung. Probably gonna go over the hole. I'm trying to spin it back. Here we go. Does that kind of make sense though? Does that answer the question of how to go about these? Let's see if I get any stars. Birdie or better, par or better on all three. I just got three, did I just get three stars? I think I just did. Yeah, three stars, there you go. Just make sure you shot shape and uh, make sure you calcu calcu calculate it in. You spin with L1, yeah, L1, LB, whatever you're using. Just tap that and then use whatever your stick is. So I use the right stick, that chooses the direction. All right, cool. All right, so let's hop over and play my TGC rounds three and four. It's a beautiful Friday night, so I don't want to, you know, take up everyone's Friday night. Go enjoy it. If you're watching later, I appreciate you. No problem. If you ever have any other challenges, let me know what these live streams are going to be. And then, uh, yeah. I'm not going to do any warm-up. We're just going to go right in it. Just going to take the beating. Kinetic. See if we can post a top 20. I think we got to go to like 35 under. We really started grooving the last one. We had a 10 under round, but it could have easily been like 14 under. So it'll, it'll be interesting. Hello there. My name is John McCarthy, and oh, I would like to get, welcome you to the to PGA Tour 2K23. Hopefully everything is going well on your oh, end. Oh, we got a lot of wind here. Four staring us down here on the first hole. Now let's strike this drive into the fairway and get on our way. All right, let's have All a right, good round today. Have fun out there. And just in the light rough at the moment. Oh, shoot. That's like a 20 mile an hour wind. I got to play this like 30 yards. I hit this like 195, to be honest. I want to be left of this flag as well. Come on, kick left. Oh, I just pushed. Damn. Good good yardage though. Okay, good calculations the safely. There. Can still make this. This putt is very, very long. Just uh do what you can. See if we can get this close, maybe. Where's the vibration? Wow. 
All right, is putting is a little bit different. Feet. Definitely missed the vibration there. Oh, it's getting there. Bit long on that one. All right, we knew this was going right, to take a second or so to get used to. Okay, starting the round. Did not want to drop a stroke there today, on the early part. But uh, hopefully we can shave some strokes oh. off as we progress. This is going to be a real tough wind. wind is blowing hopefully we got some par. Right. Oh, this is a par five, and it's not with the wind at my back. Great swing. Wow. We're in the big. A couple big, bad big bounces here. here. Kick hard off of that. Okay, still in the rough after that shot, but uh, we made progress. All right. Still like 19, 20. Um, I'm not trying to do this on purpose. All of the, I've got EA controls in my head, and I'm hitting the... So I need to hit like 47 don't have that. If I go short, it's okay, though. It's going to knock down. Actually, we're in a 92% lie, so let's keep this. Come back down that hill. And that'll do. Grab your putter. 15 feet to the cup from here. Um, I like to use the pick. Nope, not high enough. I like to use the pick. The blast runs a bit, and if you, uh, um, if you're curious, in my short game, I have a short game video on the best ones to use. I cover the bunker as well. There's a video up on that if you want to check that out. It's flags 138. 18. Should be pretty good. How does that wind not affect it at this all? Putt is for it's a bird. wedge. So unrealistic. A wedge would the wind would affect it the most. Okay, 13 feet to the hole. Going towards that hole. There we go. Good par Let's save there. Good par, par save nice, there. Jake, you saved your money, my man. I appreciate it, though. But you save your money. Par. All right, put this one out in the fairway. Do I like 2K23 better than EA? Um... I like the oh goodness look how much this went. I like the fact that uh, 2K23 has setting up with a sandy old lie. I like the fact that 2K23 has an entire community like TGC Tours where you can really compete in so many different skill levels oh, and divisions. Going to the sand. What I don't setting like for our third shot is pretty much. <laughs> yes, this is not PGA. Uh, we just did a whole couple rounds on PGA. Um, but I like EA better. This hole, we've got this left for par. My person, now that I've played a bunch of uh, them for uh, quite a bit, my personal opinion, I, I really like what EA has it's come up with. getting there. Just, I think uh, you can yeah, just do so many more things with the game. Good job with that chip shot. And 14 under is your score. <laughs> you can literally save your money. You don't up have to do that. Four. Looking good off the tee. Okay, setting up here about 140. What do you mean by that? Fortnite of golden games. Of golf games. Yeah, I, oh, you mean more like arcadey and not as realistic? 
more cartoony. Dylan's approach is leaning you a bit to the right. Do anything. Setting up here now for our third shot. This isn't even enjoyable, to be honest. Yeah, I agree. I would agree. All right, this is your fourth shot. Nice. Chip. I would definitely agree. All right, putting uh, here for both. EA to me feels a lot more realistic than uh, um, wind blowing left to right on this one. Than uh, 2K. Oh, effortless. This feels like a swing. video game. When sometimes when I play EA, I'm like, wow, this actually feels like you go. I'm playing for Eagle here now on this par four. In real life. And here's a look for Eagle. I know I'm not playing in real life, but the fact is that like it just has so many characteristics that you you would apply to your actual oh my. Short, that, that you would apply to your actual real life golf game. That it's really cool um, that, one, that if you're skilled score, enough and you understand a lot of things, that you actually can uh, take advantage of it. This could be a bit long. Of course, the wind takes goes. that one. Oh, uh, missed the green on that one. Okay, careful on this one. We're in the green side rough. Well, that's a nice chip. Well done. I feel like you play... Nice 2K is a game where you can play and be done in, like, and here we go. Let's 15 see what minutes. Here on like, the it's, peop it's for golf, for people in a hurry. And setting it's up good to hear. I'm happy to hear that. Out. That's exactly what it's for. I appreciate you letting me know that it's successful. I just put out a putting video for everyone who wants putting tips. Also, where to apply your skills okay, from, the green side, from what Sam, I found to be the most useful stuff. Here. So, hopefully, that information will be just as successful. Like, that's a shot out of the bunker. Come on now. Should right, not run out of like that, that bunker and putting. Let's see what happens. All right, if you can sink this, snatch a birdie and be on our way. Ah, uh, it's not far enough. Seven foot putt coming up. Looking good. That's gonna work. I got the slow motion shot today. If you guys know what that is, 14 under <laughs> after that hole. You, did you hole in one, or was it? Uh, did you make it out of the fairway. On this one. Got a little heartbeat moment. This isn't Unlocked. even like a fun win to play in. Whoever did set this course shot up. On the ninth. See, so like this actually is a perfect example to answer your question. So, there, I'm playing this round here. And there is a 20 like. mile an hour wind in my face. And I have no choice but to just continually hit full shots or partial shots, which and still go to a, a lower, a this more, going. a higher height. All right, in the cup for the par. When in EA, 14 under you can score. hit knockdown shots, you can hit runners, you can essentially take the here. wind out of it. In this game, you can't do that. You have to play whatever the wind is. You can't get creative with it. And whatever the wind tells you you're going to do is what you do. Like, I had to yeah, hit a running that. shot there up to a green yeah, on a this part three. 19 feet. And that's one oh, of the things on, that I really... Oh, that I really don't like about this game. Setting up for the par pot here. You can get Not so creative with current it. Current score... Congratulations on that ace. Under par. Par five like just being able to get so creative with all of the different shots nice and play the course in so many different ways is what makes that game more fun to me. Okay, second shot on Which the Which keeps it, in my opinion, like, like you want to keep on playing. Because earlier today, we played that round at uh, St. Andrews and like... 
You can play the slopes shot. if you want to play the slopes. You don't have to carry it everywhere. And when you play the game, if you played St. Andrews here, right, here's a five you would actually five. have to this one's carry driving. everything. If you nice. want to hit a four iron, yeah, it has to go birdie. all 215 yards. 15 under. But you can hit a four iron 300 yards in EA. Which more resembles realistic golf. And, and I know I'm kind of like rambling yeah, here, about but I hope that just kind of, that kind of makes some sense. See, I'll hit a knockdown shot here, see what it does in the wind. Still runs on. That's safe. And this pot for the birdie. This one's on a good line. Yikes, that went right by. All right, tap this one on in. We'll head to the next. What are we, two under? And after that hole, I know, we were, like we're two over right now. Under is where you sit. Okay, lengthy par four ahead of us here. Get this out there. Good stuff. All right, here's our second shot on the 13th. There we go. Yep, that's gonna work. All right, you've got about six feet here. 18? Wow. It's like 13. Amazing. And after that one, I feel like I'm playing this game in a, like a blackout. It just goes so quickly. You can't really slow yourself down. I mean, you could, but at the same time, like, it's just unnecessary. And from the green side, sand. Looking for an up and down here. Go in, go in, go in. Oh. Oh, Fighting the back. touch onto that. Nicely played out of that sand. And after that hole, you are... I feel like there should be speed golf. Under par. And 2K should be it. See what happens on the 15th hole of this course. Like, when I play 2K now, I just think about... That'll do. Going back and playing yeah, we're about a, I don't know, 200 yards or so from the pin from here. I think that's a sign you made a pretty good golf game. Uh, the approach is heading a bit to the right. When you play your competitor's golf this game, but at the third. same time, you just would rather go play EA. So I guess that, in the long, answers your question, Jake, save. of which game I actually You're prefer. Currently sitting I mean, I still get, I'll still play both. Par. But I am leaning more towards EA these days. We got a left to right breeze on this hole. <sighs> Yikes. This is a par five. Alrighty. Four. Second Not shot on the 16th. It. Get up. Ah, that didn't hit the mark, did it? Okay, no, third it shot. Not a bad recovery. All right, we've got this so left for par. Save this par here. Well, the putt appears to be online. Ooh. Nice. Good That's par save. Good par work. save. That's for par. And after that hole, you stand at 17 under par. But you, you can also just tell that they care. 17. Just by how much patch notes they just put out, right? So, like, I don't know if you guys saw those patch notes, but they put out so many patch notes on the approach. just to show the community that they are actually trying really hard and they really care. When was the last time you've seen any sports game do something like that? About six feet to go here. This putt's good so far. Okay, good job on this one. I feel like I... And yeah, I agree, Emporium. Hole, you are currently 17 under par. And Back to even par now here. For the I think I can hole. make this. Holy See if I can make the water here. That was smash. Oh, wow, I did. Setting up about 115 yards out. I think we're going to start playing some online matches in, uh, in 2K. I mean, not 2K, in EA soon. On next week's live stream. 
You'll be all right there. And this one is for not the best three. round I've ever played. Oh, oh, wow, I didn't make that. All right, give Get this one here. a little tap. And as we wind down here, Even 17 par round. under par for you. And with that, I will let you I go. I don't want to get Thank a demotion mark. So, see if we can throw in a better round here. Hello there, and welcome to this. I understand why the, the rounds were par so four, low. First hole as we start our day today. Time to put this in the fairway. What do you say? I was looking to see why nice swing. people in our division didn't really, after go. going 17 Off under in the front nine, forward or the to, uh, first fantastic two round rounds. Else. Let's do some fun. Let's get out of this. This is uh, what happened. Spinachy for my liking. But now I, it all makes sense. Well, you tried, you just didn't quite hit this green. All right, you know what? Actually, I don't even care anymore. This one to save par. I just don't have as much fun playing this game as I have playing EA. Oh, so I have to ask effort. myself, like, why am I playing that, this uh, game? Wow, 16 under after that hole. Here's a par five. I agree. Especially for the putting. I think it'll land in the fairway. Could could head into the rough, though. We're going to have to be real careful with this. It's deep into this rough. Okay, nicely done. You're in the fairway now. Let's hit up onto that green. We are about 140 yards Six. out. Coming in for a landing here on the green. Go. And there we go. Nice little approach shot. Yeah, this I'm gonna. Um, I don't know if you guys have ever seen early 1981's channel. Tracking. Uh, I'm pretty and friendly with him and the guys, so I'm gonna get last, some matches on like on here with them. But obviously, I'm in the U.S. and they're in. Uh, under par. Some of them are in Scotland, well, some of them are in, are in Ireland, so that one. will, uh, we'll have to figure out the time zone change for all of that. But that's essentially the goal. Well done. Like I told you guys, the next couple birdies. weeks or so, um, that was I have some nice. final stuff back going back on birdies. with things outside of this channel in real life. Uh, and then once the summer hits, I'll have a lot more time. Yeah, that was a good swing. In well between. Done. Yeah, so. Uh, but I've already and contacted early. I mean, me and him, we, we chat. I'm in his Discord. So um, we talk about these games. I saw he just actually became the, a creator uh, for EA, which is pretty cool. Okay, here's our third shot. And then, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll get some live matches on here. I think that's where we're going to end up start taking these live streams. Ooh, nice little chip on that one. Playing the TGC rounds are fun and all, moment. but I don't really feel like doing it live on stream anymore because on the fifth. I'm really enjoying EA and I'd like to bring Beautiful more swing. EA content to this channel rather than 2K content. But I will help anybody who does want to stay on 2K and continue. Um, I will help if there's anything specific you need help with 2K. A little bit to the right on the approach here. And this is your third like, How shot. does that not go down? And with this pot, you could save par. Good luck. And in the hole. What are we okay, doing after that hole, sitting there at 18 under par. We got a left to right breeze on this hole. Should run up it there. Looks like we're gonna be um, in the fairway. Yeah, it's pretty good. Here's our second shot on this sixth hole. Should be able to land it right here. And it should be able to run right down to the flag. Tap this in for bird. Great chip shot there, pure. That's pure. Let's go. That is fine. What position work. does it say we're in now? T55. Not great. Not the best I've ever done. That should be really good. Should be really good. Oh my goodness, there it just go. didn't bounce. Oh, that's what you like want. Here is a 12 footer. 
No, oh, it's getting there. Never high enough. No, that's going right by the hole, isn't it? Never high enough. Some of these guys shot lights out this week. Teeing it up on the eighth hole. This one's the par five. We can reach in two, I believe. Oh yeah, we can reach this in two. Should be absolute money. Let's watch this one. Come on. Get there. Grow some legs. Get the legs. There you go. This is this Good is an eagle opportunity here. Eagle next. There we go. Oh yes. Two and That's one. That's gonna go down for the eagle. This is a much better round. Much more enjoyable. I mean, I would enjoy the heavy winds in this game if you actually could get creative with some shots. The fact is, you, you gotta just can't really have multiple different Good options. Shots. We've got about 115 yards to the pin. Come on, there's a hill right there. It should work left, or it's just nice gonna stop there. Nice work. That was some good golf. And sink this next putt, and you'll grab that birdie. Oh, just ah, no good. And it just good luck here. starts to go. right. Oh my! Um, did you did you enable sharing? You have to enable sharing. Looking good. Solid work. That's for bogey. So, um. If you go into now on a par three, if it ever loads, you go into social. No, not social. Those are my friends. You go into settings and then you go into social. Third party data access. Make sure this is enabled. Uh, make sure that's enabled, and then you essentially should be able to um, log in to the the website with the email that you set up. Did you also set up an email Maybe a and then attach your the gamer tag to it? We're on the green with that one. Well done. This is a super long putt. No two ways around it. Let's see how you do. Ooh, that's going to be too far. I go off the green. Well, it's going right by the hole. Yep, it's off the green. Setting up for our third shot. Oh, what a oh, backdoor par. par with oh. chip. There's a move. And, oh yeah, we're going to look at that one again. I saw my round on the webpage, but can't see where I ended up. Um. So, what division are you in? And the wind is picked up. We got a tailwind to deal with. Because if you're logged in and you're in the proper division, so it will sit your name will be at the top of the pay, uh, top of the Nicely leaderboard done. in a separate Second section. You're on the eleventh. And it will give you a number, it'll tell you if you were cut or not. Um, so on and so forth. And this is our third shot. Do you start spamming L1 in the air or when it's on the ground in the air? As soon as it leaves the club, you can start hitting L1. But be careful. You don't always have to spam it, you know. Sometimes uh, spamming it can shot. be too much. Okay, this will save you par. Okay, well played. Uh, so, when you log in, uh, I can pull it up, up on mine. Part four. Uh, here, let me... Uh, I don't remember what... Alright. Hold on, I got you. I got you.
All right, make sure my screen is good. All right, so you can see here on my home screen, it says my name at the top, and then it says what division I'm in. So I'm in the kinetic division, so it says kinetic right there. And then if you go over to whatever, whatever one is here is whatever division you're in. So if you click full leaderboard, you can see I'm at the top here. You got your world golf ranking, and then you can also click on your name. And it will give you everything that you need for, for everything. Look at that. Helping out in other ways than just playing the video game. This is about 160 to the pin. Well done. That's a nice little approach shot there. It could be a good one. I need to just start mashing into these too breaks. Too firm on that one. Here we go. This next one for par. But I hope that helps. And let's see what happens here on the 13th hole. Yeah, that'll play. Okay, this is uh, about that means, yeah, you, or you should so just, I think hit. you play, you'd have to look. I would say make sure two things. You have third-party data access sharing. Um, make sure that is on. And then make sure your gamer tag is set up to well, the account that you created course. on whatever system you're on. Good work there. Check all those boxes first. And then I believe all you have to do is just play the challenge circuit tournament. And that oh, will... My goodness. And that will just pre uh, pre drop you in the following week into whatever division fits what your score was. I don't think you actually have to now. play a qualifying anymore. Okay, and from the sand. All right, not a whole lot of work left to do here. Nice shot. All right, this one's about nine feet from the car. Finally, crop. a made putt. Nice stroke on that one. That's your fourth birdie of the day. All right, let's see what we can do off the tee here. It's a long par four. Okay, there we go. And we've got about 150 yards to the pin from here. Ah, I pushed it. That's on me. Hopefully we Damn, get a bounce to the two. left. Yeah, that'll work. Uh, nice approach for the birdie. Looking really good. Oh. Uh, rolled right by. And the putt drops and we're moving on. Okay, I have a good tee shot here now on the 16th. couple of holes left here um if there's any last okay, questions or challenges or things that you guys want go. me to cover uh let me know you guys know i'll be live again next week Approach shot and then i'll be taking a week off because i have actual golf tournaments to that i'm playing in myself so i will be busy What's well, heading towards the hole? Because no, I'll be busy. Tough, uh, it's a little bit, a little bit too hard on that one. Okay, here's a power putt. Yeah, and if you keep on struggling with it, um, there just they're pretty responsive as well. Um, TGC, their support team is they're pretty responsive. Teeing so now on the 17th. just hit them up and they will, uh, they will respond. And those, oh, that's a horrible shot. Going a bit left of the pin. But they'll tell you exactly. Oh yeah, 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 I will do that. Good, good point. Ooh, nicely done on the chip. Might shot. have to play. I can't fast forward. 
And let's Can you pick bring this thing tea? home now on can. the 18th tee. But that's a good, good point. Well done. Setting up here 145 yards away. Finish off this TGC let's round. Kick left here. A bird, maybe? Okay, we're on the green. And if you sink this, guaranteed a 66 on the scorecard. All right, Let's go the finish drops, off with the bird. I guess that means I'm off the clock. Let's go on to the 16th. And that's going to do it 17. for us here today. Thank you so much. 16, 16, 16, 16. We'll see you next time. All right. That, that's, that's done. Mm-hmm. Social. No, I don't want any of that. Casual. Local match. Official. It's a lot of official courses. Closer. We're gonna have to do the back nine only. All right, back nine only. No problem, Oz. Thanks for hopping in. You too. Let's see. I mean, Schusler, I mean, I'm, I'm fully supportive with being wrong. And today we're just taking a nibble at this course, playing the back nine. There's only one way to find out. We put it to the test. Obviously, these shots don't matter. I feel like this game plays a lot better in the sun. of distance left to the hole, but hey, we're not in a bunker, so... Happy days. Get there. Definitely look in sixty per frames time. per second. It definitely looks a lot better so in the sun. So good. We're starting things off at even par. Three stars. To Happy to hear it. Lovely way to start your round. Birdies are out there though. Here's our second shot on hole number 11. I'm just mass playing this for anyone who's wondering, nice just because I'm trying to get to hole 17. Okay. Could be a birdie on the scorecard if you drop this. Oh, man. And five feet left to go. Nice little stroke in there, in there for par. Yeah, you might need a little 12. more power. We've got a headwind on this hole. We'll go in the hole. Oh. Nicely done. All right, here we go for the birdie. Okay, that'll bring it down to one under. See how fast I can play this. Here we go now on the 13th. Ooh, that's a bad shot. Well, I think I'll oh, take not, that tee shot. Looks good. Okay, about 235 yards left to go. Sounds are, are really good in this game, I will say. They did a really good job uh, for our getting the, the sounds of all the clubs. Okay, best of luck with this one. 16 footer. Look at me, I'm on fire! Okay, let's do this hole number 14, ready to go. Nice, that's uh, some solid contact. There we go. What are you calling this me? This was around 185 yards to the pin. Notice the wind is picking up as we go throughout this round. Well, that'll do for now. 
Sink this, you can move down to three under. Ooh. And just drop this on. All right, we're can what, two holes left. And team this one up on the 15th hole. This drive should be safe. Whoops, ended up in the rough. I thought that was gonna be better. All right, let's get out of this first cut and uh, on our way. Take that hill. Come on down. All right, here we go. The stadium, I see it. I see the walls. Let's see which one looks better. There. Like I said, I'm, I'm going into this open-minded. Your putt for Eagle. Oh, what eagle could have been three eagle. under? Actually, could have been an eagle. Okay, one, it looks pretty good. Down to three under. In this hole, we got a tailwind to deal with. I like the cheering. The cheering is definitely better because um, I will give it that. How they're getting rowdy. Because when you play EA, they're all sitting down quiet. Obviously, the looks of the crowd isn't as good. I think the buildings look a lot taller, and it re really feel like you're more in a stadium. This, I kind of feel like it's not so much in a stadium. It's just like there's stands there. All right, let me make sure I hit the green. Maybe this one I'll kick to the Let's left. Let's hear the crowd. Yep, that's going to do all this. All right, actually. all right. It's Four not delayed. I will say right EAs here. were delayed. I mean, but also, like, look at that crowd. Yeah, it's not delayed, a delayed reaction. Like, in EAs, you definitely have that there. Completely, 100% agree, but, like, Look at the emptiness of that bleacher. Plus, the other one was like three times the height. You couldn't even see the sky. You actually felt enclosed in it. We're here in the crowd. Sigh, yeah, yeah. No, no, I, I, I would say, yeah. The crowd reaction, you're, you're right on that. It's more, more, it's not delayed, it's more spot on. I will say the EA crowd definitely they booed me when I missed the green, but it was after the fact. Uh, after I started lining up for my next shot, it wasn't like the immediate feedback. So I will say um, yes yes and no. I think EA looks better. Um, I will say the crowd reaction, you, you're kind of you're kind of on that one where it actually was um, a little bit more responsive from the actual crowd. And you've got this left for your eagle. Oh my, we're not even on the green anymore. Guess we might as well just finish this back nine out now, now that we're here, huh? Like. Oh, look at here. Nice chip. Okay, let's move on. And we're working with the tailwind on this hole. In EA? Or in 2K. Shot here on number 18. Unfortunately, I think. Uh, yeah, I am watching a little bit of the Zero Classic. I, I love the uh, the Fitzpatrick Bros just taking it low the other day. Nice work. Yeah, I feel like um. Looking pretty good. I don't know. I don't, I don't want to be the one to say it, and I don't want to be the one to sway a bunch of people, but I do feel like EA's product, give it give it some time with a couple more updates. I feel like it's going to be, um, it's going to be the superior golf game, and especially in the next couple of years, if they figure out how to get online play a little bit better, they get some ranked game modes, some, um, some, they figure out how to make it a little bit more difficult in certain areas. I think that will be um, it will be hard to beat. But 2K also runs on a two-year cycle. So they got two years to get it together, two years to figure it out. And uh, we'll see what they come up with. I don't know if EA is going to run a two-year cycle or not. So we'll see.
got the hiccups. But hey, I appreciate you all watching. That's going to be it. Go enjoy your Friday nights. Thank you for um, always being being there, subscribing. I hope the putting tutorial helps. What's in my bag helps. And I will catch you all next week. Later.